Today's video is a Jeopardy game honoring our beloved host, Alex Trebek. Come and see how much you know about this awesome man. What up though, Bible trivia, Jeopardy and Alex Trebek fans alike. Welcome to the Activity Ministry channel. My name is Pete Rock and here on this channel, I engage you in ways to get deeper into the Bible in fun and interactive ways. And one of my favorite ways of doing that is by Bible trivia in the form of Jeopardy. Sadly, we lost our beloved host back in December of 2020 due to pancreatic cancer. Now, shortly after he died, I went ahead and read his uh, memoir. And I thought it was pretty cool, but I wanted to kind of honor him in a way here on my YouTube channel. So I thought what well, would be awesome is if I could come up with ways to give you trivia on the Bible like I normally do, but then also allow you to learn more about Alex Trebek that I read from his memoir. So that's exactly what we're doing in this video. We're combining the two, Bible trivia and Alex Trebek. We're bringing them together in a nice, new, fun way to learn about a great man and also learn about things of God as well. Now, before we get started, I do want to share with you one little tip that I've set up during for this game in the following ways. Whenever possible, I will add the Bible verse that provides the correct answer to the clue in the black line. As you can see here, it's Matthew 16, 9. Now, the reason I do this is if you're playing the game with someone new to the Bible, it will allow you to pause the game and open up the Bible to that verse to find the answer. And that will hopefully open up further discussion of the context surrounding that verse to encourage a deeper understanding. So hopefully this will make this game easier to share in Sunday schools, youth groups, and home groups. And in case you didn't know it, you can actually download this game from the description below. And if you ever have any problems downloading it, uh, let me know in the comments and I'll get it fixed as soon as possible. And that's all I had for the tip. And now let's play Jeopardy. Here are today's categories. General Jeopardy, the theme song, Charities, Soulmates, Like the Word, Famous People, and typically we only have six categories, but in honored Alex Trebek, we have three extra categories, and they are Color, Animals, and Numbers, French Words, The Fight. All right, and as always, we're going to start on the left hand column and work our way to the right until we get to Final Jeopardy. So let's go ahead and get started. Good luck, fans. For $100, question from category General Jeopardy. Three weeks after they were married, Jean, Alex's wife, found out she was pregnant. Shortly after Jean and Alex had their first child, a son whose name equals that of the first gospel book was born. What is Matthew? Next question. Instead of the star, Alex insisted on being introduced as this, which God re is referred to as the Lord of throughout the Bible. What is host? Initial number of games a person could win before being retired as an undefeated champion. Also, the number of loaves Jesus started with to feed the multitude of 5,000. What is five? In the early years of Jeopardy, Alex helped to find contestants by going on the road and grading a test with this many questions. When Jesus was on the road feeding the multitudes, he had the disciples arrange the people in groups of the same number. What is 50? The Jews then said, it has taken blank years to build this temple, and will you raise it up in three days? This blank is also the number of days Alex worked in a year as host of Jeopardy. What 
What is 46? Okay, next category, the theme song. Interesting and true, Merv Griffin wrote the theme song to Jeopardy. This person wrote the most of the songs from the Bible. Who is King David? The name of the Jeopardy theme song and the word that completes this verse. When I blank on my ways, I turn my feet to your testimonies. What is think? So the original name of the theme song was think and the complete verse is when I think on my ways, I turn my feet to your testimonies. Psalms 119.59. The Jeopardy theme song was originally written by Merv Griffin as a lullaby for his son originally named A Blank for Tony. You could probably use more of it right now, but the best I can do is provide this hint. For I consider that the sufferings of this present blank are not worth comparing with the glory that is to be revealed to us. What is time? For I consider that the sufferings of this present time are not worth comparing with the glory that is to be revealed to us. Hallelujah. The amount of money Merv Griffin earned in his lifetime from the theme song of Jeopardy, don't know? Just add a million behind the age of Moses when he commanded Pharaoh to let God's people go. What is $80 million? He basically earned $3 million a year for 24 years from that song or the theme song. And last question for this category. A common question from fans to Alex would be, does he ever get tired of hearing the Jeopardy song? To which Alex replied, no, it's just part of the blank. Hint. Instead of getting angry with the same questions, Alex represented this verse in the book of 1 Peter, which says, blank hospitality to one another without grumbling. What is show? So he would say it was just part of the show. And 1 Peter 4, 9, show hospitality to one another without grumbling. Next category is charities. A local charity that Alex contributed to is Blank of the Valley Rescue Mission. Allow the Apostle Paul to help you where he encourages us all to rejoice in blank, be patient in tribulation, be constant in prayer. What is hope? Rejoice in hope. Be patient in tribulation. Be constant in prayer. Romans 12, 12. This set the Jews aside as God's chosen people, but Alex fought to stop it for females in northern Kenya. What is circumcision? Alex adopted a village in Zambia with the goal of helping them get fresh water with new wells. World Vision created a plaque thanking Alex, ending in John 7.37 with these words from Jesus, If anyone is thirsty, let him come to me and blank. What is drink? So here's a picture of the plaque. So John 7, 37, Jesus stood up and cried out, If anyone thirsts, let him come to me and drink. Next question. Alex agreed with Bert Bacharach's song that demands what the world needs now is this action that God's word says is patient and kind. What is love? 1 Corinthians 13.4 states, Love is patient and kind. Love does not envy or boast. It is not arrogant. 
In his book, Alex declares that the business communities and people in politics need this word that completes this Hebrew verse. Pray for us, for we are sure that we have a clear blank, desiring to act honorably in all things. What is conscience? Pray for us, for we are sure that we have a clear conscience, desiring to act honorably in all things. Next category is soulmates. So this whole category is around Alex and his wife, Jean, who he calls Jeannie. So Alex jokes that Jeannie, his soulmate, got pregnant when she fell off this animal that is called out in the book of Revelation as wearing breastplates the color of fire and of sapphire and of sulfur. And fire and smoke and sulfur came out of their mouths. What is a horse? Number of years Alex and Jean were married. Also, the pieces of silver Judas accepted to betray Jesus. What is 30? 30 years and 30 pieces of silver. When Alex first met her, Jean's profession matched that of the apostle Matthew. What is accountant slash bookkeeper? Alex and Jean were soulmates. Likewise, this book in the Bible is commonly interpreted as an allegory of God's love for Israel. What is Song of Solomon? Age difference between Alex and Jeannie, also the number of elders surrounding the throne in the book of Revelation. What is 24? And that takes us to our next category, like the word. Alex's dad spoke three languages, Polish, Ukrainian, and Russian. Likewise, the Bible was originally written in these three languages. What is Hebrew, Aramaic, and Greek? It betrayed Jesus, but Alex was ecstatic when he got one from his fifth grade teacher, Miss LaBabe. What is a kiss? Alex was very active in sports growing up. One of his favorite sports was basketball, but he was never the superstar in the team. Instead, he was the player that was like Jesus who provided this gift mentioned three times in John 14, 27. Blank I leave to you, my own blank I give you, a blank which the world cannot give, this is my gift to you. What is peace? Peace I leave with you, my peace I give to you, not as the world gives do I give to you, let no hearts be troubled, neither let them be afraid. Next question. Living with pancreatic cancer caused Alex's views on toughness to change. Originally, he thought not crying meant you were tough, but realized it was only suppressing your feelings, but instead crying is good, and this is backed up by these two words from John 11.35. What is Jesus wept? Alex grew up helping his dad, who was a chef, in the kitchen. Here he learned the value of the little things in life, the importance of punctuality, the rewards for hard, honest work, the pride of properly arranging tables and chairs. Likewise, God's word says, but all things should be done decently and in blank. What is order? 
All right, that takes us to our next category, famous people. So these are people that Alex met uh, before he started Jeopardy, during his time on Jeopardy, or just mentioned in the book. All right, let's go ahead and start with number one. This actor who played God in three different movies once said, the secret of a good sermon is to have a good beginning and a good ending, then have the two as close together as possible. Who is George Burns? Jesus said, ask and it will be given to you. Seek and you will find. Knock and it will be open to you. This actor who said, I am the one who knocks in the hit series Breaking Bad coached alongside Alex for their kids basketball and volleyball teams. Who is Brian Cranston? In the early years of the show, Alex would do public relations work. One morning show he appeared on was this celebrity's whose favorite Bible verse is Psalms 37.4. Delight yourself in the Lord, and he will give you the desires of your heart. She might paraphrase the verse as, you get desires of your heart, you get desires of the heart, you get desires of the heart. Who is Oprah Winfrey? Before Jeopardy, Alex met this very famous royal lady who once said, One of the things that has not changed all that much for me is the celebration of Christmas. It remains a time when I try to put aside the anxieties of the moment and remember that Christ was born to bring peace and tolerance to a troubled world. Who is Queen Elizabeth? When asked which three famous people Alex would have wanted as contestants on the show, Alex mentioned Mark Twain and this ex-wife of Frank Sinatra twice, who said, God knows I've got so many frailties myself. I ought to be able to understand and forgive them in others, but I don't. Who is Ava Gardner? Next. Category is Color, Animals, and Numbers. Hesitant to leave his role at CBC in Canada and move directly to LA on for what he believed was a temporary gig hosting the Wizard of Odds pilot, Alex decided to test the waters out by using this number of disciples' weeks worth of vacation at one time. And what's interesting about this is Alex accumulated so much vacation time is because he volunteered to fill in for the show to let older people with families actually have time off for the holidays. Great move, Alex. Next question. Alex was a fan of author and fellow Canadian Malcolm Gladwell, who believed this number was the minimum number of hours required for a person to master any craft. Also, the number of talents the servant was forgiven from paying the king in the parable of the unforgiving servant. What is 10,000? Some trust in chariots and some in blank, but we trust in the name of the Lord our God. The blank above was Alex's next favorite animal after the muskox. What are horses? The glory of young men is their strength, but the splendor of old men is their blank hair. Fill in the blank to know Alex's favorite color. What is gray? Alex would often respond that it matches his personality. <laughs> Alex's favorite animal was the muskox because of the way they can work together to create an impenetrable circle to defend their young as long as they blank. Hint, blank your work to the Lord and your plans will be established. What is commit? 
Proverbs 16, 3 says, Commit your work to the Lord, and your plans will be established. All right, next category is French words. Have you ever wondered how Alex could pronounce French words within the clue so well? That's because his mother was French, and Alex was very fluent in the language. In this category, we will be looking for a one word of French origination. So first question in this category. Though not a heavy drinker like his father, Alex could relate to wine is good for thy stomach as his favorite was this. What is Chardonnay? This French word is the title to the chapter where Alex explains his appreciation for the military. Christians can also relate to this French word through this verse, and we know that for those who love God, all things work together for good for those who are called according to his purpose. Hint, this word is a mutual trust and friendship among people who spend a lot of time together. What is camaraderie? Alex and Old Testament Judge Samson had one thing in common, the need to protect their hair. Alex decided to leave the military academy when they tried to cut his hair in this French hairstyle, originally designed for women, but later popularized by Elvis Presley and more recently, David Beckham. What is pompadour? After his parents separated, Alex began acting up in his Ottawa prep school. Just like Jesus gave the Pharisees a hard time, Alex and a priest named Father Roy had a little war with each other. The Sadducees and Father Roy could be considered this French word, meaning strict disciplinarians. What is Martinet? Joseph was arrogant, Jonah stubborn, and Peter very impulsive. In the chapter titled Toughness, Alex learned during his sickness that there is nothing wrong with admitting to a weakness. It is a sign of strength. Alex uses this French word meaning a minor weakness or eccentricity in someone's character where he says, there is nothing wrong with having this French word. I'll be super impressed if you guys got this one. What are foibles? All right, next category, the fight. In his book, Alex declares, I'm not afraid of dying. One thing they're not going to say at my funeral as part of the eulogy is he was taken from us too soon. I'm about to turn 80. I've lived a good full life and I'm nearing the end of it. I have to think that this man, the oldest recorded in the Bible, said something similar. Who is Methuselah? Alex was in extreme pain during his last tapings of Jeopardy, but he told himself repeatedly, you know what you have to do, Trebek. Do it. Keep it moving. Run the game. Like this, Likewise, this man wrote in the Bible, do you not know that in a race, all the runners run, but only one receives the prize? So run that you may obtain it. Who is the Apostle Paul? It's actually 1 Corinthians 9.24. I just realized that I didn't put it on the other page, so I do apologize for that. And the verse goes, Do you not know that in a race all the runners run, but only one receives the prize, so run that you may obtain it? During his battle with cancer, Alex wrote, I believe in the will to live. I believe in positivity. I believe in optimism. I believe in hope and I certainly believe in the power of this. This word also completes the following verse. Do not be anxious about anything, but in everything, by blank and supplication, with thanksgiving, let your requests be made known to God. What is prayer? 
Next question. Alex believed that through disasters and sicknesses, there's a will to survive, and there's a lot of luck and a lot of God's help that comes into play. Similar thoughts can be captured in the book of Ecclesiastes, commonly believed to be written by this man. Who is King Solomon? Jesus said, Blank have holes, and birds of the air have nests, but the Son of Man has nowhere to lay his head. On thoughts of God, Alex wrote that he believed no one is an atheist in this animal's hole. What is a foxhole? All right, and that concludes our regular game. We're now going to move into Final Jeopardy. Good luck, players. The category is family. Alex did not know he had won until right around when he started hosting Jeopardy at the age of 44. Jesus had four of them. And the answer is, what is a half-brother? I would recommend reading the book for the extra insights to the man Alex Trebek. If you're an audiobook fan, most of the book is narrated by Ken Jennings, but there are some cameo chapters read by Alex Trebek himself, which is pretty cool. And though he doesn't say it at the end of the Kindle book, Alex does advise within the audiobook that all the proceeds of the book will be going to a well-known charities to help people out. So I encourage you to buy the book, to learn more about Alex Trebek and give to these great causes in honor of our favorite game show host. What I love about Jeopardy is that it's set up in the format unlike any other game show where the contestants are given the answers and it's up to them to respond with the correct questions. The Word of God is set up the very same way. It is full of all the answers you, you need. You just have to take the time and dig into it to find the questions of your mind, heart, and soul. My channel is dedicated to interacting with God's Word and fellowshipping with people on YouTube. One way I do that is by gathering favorite Bible verses, and each month they are entered into a monthly giveaway on my channel. So let's fellowship together. Please take a moment and leave your favorite Bible verse in the comments below. I hope you enjoyed this special edition of Bible Jeopardy honoring Alex Trebek. Until next time, be blessed, be a blessing, I be out.